Hey there, fellow Clasher. Jorge Yao here, bringing you the most successful, most secret, hottest game strategies on how to win in Clash of Clans. Why follow my tactics? Well, you might know me as the first player to reach 4,000, 4,100, and 4,200 trophies in Clash of Clans. I still hold the highest record in the game today at 4,224 trophies. I have also maintained the number one spot in the Clash of Clans official rankings for six months straight since January 2013, the longest to ever do so. Dominating the game from start to finish wasn't a walk in the park. With so many changes in each and every patch update by Supercell, the developers of this great game, I've learned from many players throughout this journey and have developed those lessons into this strategy guide, which I'm going to share with you today. Using this, many of my fellow North 44 clanmates were able to raise their gameplay and today we hold 8 out of the top 10 positions in the world. Guys like Kamal, Tetwa, MD Shaf1, Papa Army, Panda Russia, Shrek and others all hold number 1 positions in the regions by adhering to this strategy. Now, what you're about to discover is exactly how I did it and how you can copy what I did to get the same results. Picture this. You've played Clash for a couple of weeks, maybe a couple of months now. In the beginning, it was really fun and you steadily climbed in trophy count. Beaming at your accomplishments, you decide to buy a couple gems and continue your progress. But instead of resuming the climb, you get stuck. You're a beginner and you can't quite make it to intermediate. You're an intermediate and you can't quite make it to champion league. You're in champion league, but you can't quite make it to top 50, the top 20, or maybe even top 10. Let me tell you something. You're clashing all wrong. So I'm here to ask you a simple question. How much is it worth to you to have me, or Hey Yao, take you by the hand and show you everything you need to do to be successful in Clash of Clans? When I first started playing, I was in the same boat. I even wanted to quit several times. But then I discovered all the secrets to success in Clash and thus started my incredible journey to becoming the number one player in the world. I was the top player in the world for 6 months running, the most dominant and consistent clasher since the game launched. My clan North 44 has followed me in this journey and is the top clan in the world. Even our feeder clans are ranked in the top 200, including Loyalty 44 who is in the top 10. But what do all my successful clanmates have in common? After joining the North 44 army, all of these guys have followed my strategies and risen to the top of the regional leaderboard. Several have even broken 4,000 trophies and held the top 5 slots in the world. Among my top strategies I discuss is my top secret blueprint on showing you exactly what to do with your gold and elixir, to show you how to position your army to start any defense, how and who to raid for resources or trophies, and best of all, my shield strategy, so you can have a life outside of Clash. It's basically everything you need to know about Clash of Clans. Listen, I know there are tons of YouTube videos out there. Supercell has even put together a comprehensive wiki that describes everything about Clash. 90% of that information is just irrelevant. You really need to know a few things and concentrate on those specific aspects of the game to be successful. I will hold your hand and guide you every step of the way to have the most powerful units at your side, maxed out hero units, and the safest and quickest way to climb the ranks to compete in the Champions League. You and I both know, Clash of Clans is extremely competitive. If you're just starting out and hoping to learn everything by yourself, you're bound to make a huge number of mistakes, some even impossible to recover from unless you throw money at the game. It's unreasonable to expect someone new to the game, even someone who started during the beta, to keep up with all the patches, changes, and updates by Supercell all the time. Worse still, can somebody new to the game even afford to make costly mistakes early in the game when resources are tight and every little bit counts? The reason you're here is because you realize by now that Clash of Clans isn't your average game. 
You probably think that in order to rise in level and compete against others, you'll need to invest a huge chunk of your monthly income. You think it may impede on your social life or job. You think you'll get there someday. I've got news for you. Someday is a dangerous word. It's really just code for never. You're committed to thinking that leveling is something that occurs naturally. You're locked into the mindset that as long as you slowly upgrade your base's defenses, you'll grow enough to take on other players. The sad truth is, time is your most valuable resource. Players who think you need to sacrifice time to get anywhere in Clash of Clans are all wrong. Trust me, the time I spent researching while at home, at work, even on my phone, come up to weeks of research when put together. I was at the number one spot for six months in a row. Think about all the numerous patches that I've been through adapting to each update to not only maintain my position, but to strengthen my hold of it. What I'm saying is, I've been there and I know what's needed to succeed. That's what I'm here to tell you right here, right now. You can spend minimal time and use gems more efficiently by knowing exactly what to do at each ranking tier, doubling or tripling your progress in the same amount of time it would usually take. By the time I'm done with you, you'll be one of the elite, like me. I'll teach you how to raid intelligently for resources, defend your base against anyone brave enough to raid you, and exactly which structure is higher priority to upgrade first at any given level. When I first started Clash of Clans, there was no information about the game. It was buggy as heck, and everyone was simply stumbling around making a mess of things. No one knew the mechanics at the time, and those who were quick to learn had a huge advantage. Myself, just starting out, I wasted the first pile of free gems provided to me by the game to shorten the upgrading of my resource buildings. Later, I realized I needed those free gems to purchase an additional builder hut. At that level, having an additional builder hut was crucial. This was the worst experience I've had in Clash of Clans ever. If you've worked on something for that long, as hard as I did, and suddenly have everything turn against you so suddenly, you'll know exactly how I feel. And the worst part of it all, I knew there was really no way I could have avoided it based on the information I had on Clash of Clans at the time. Not quite a fair price to pay just for being a new player, is it? I love Clash of Clans. It wasn't about to give up. Not then, not now. I know that for every player that gets up and brushes it off, there are probably five others which didn't and simply uninstalled the game. That's why I'm giving you this information right here on this page. So are you ready to discover the definitive guide to Clash of Clans? Because I'm here to help you make your mark in Clash of Clans. This includes anything from surviving as a newbie clasher, to what to expect when your newbie shields go down, and everything from there onwards to the Champion League. Now to make this an easy decision for you, and make this available to as many people as possible, I'm going to give you a 100% risk free guarantee. Let me explain. I know that you're anxious to know the same strategies and techniques that the pros use in Clash of Clans. I know that you have the best chance of proving to yourself that you have what it takes by using the information we have in our exclusive club. So I'm going to take all the responsibility on my shoulders, making sure that if you aren't 100% elated by my amazing primer, I'll give you a full refund. All you need to do is shoot me an email, and in 48 hours, your membership will be canceled and you'll be refunded in full. Clash of Clans is an extremely competitive game and if you're looking to get to the top, I'm your best bet. Your competition is probably using these techniques against you right now. The only question you need to answer is whether you want to take advantage and protect yourself from the inevitable onslaught. The gains are immeasurable, the losses devastating if you aren't in the loop. I know you'll make the right choice. Click the add to cart button below to get started. I'm Jorge Yao and I'll see you on the inside.